Come on, let me break down the bathroom doors. No, all right. Well, I peed myself a clone. You know, I'm fine. Okay, it's gonna give me... I don't need bullets. If it's just gonna be nothing but bullets over and over again. Uh, hmm. I don't know, this is a lot of supplies. I'm starting to suspect that I may be walking into... Uh, a... A segment of enhanced action and danger. Perhaps a showdown against a uh, man or a construct. That's gonna be more bullets, I'm sure. Yep. No, they are, they are pumping me full of lead. Uh-oh. Okay, that's a lot longer than it needs to be. Ow! I thought... I thought another one was gonna pop up. It's fine. Okay, we wait. Then I, I bet I can make it too. Uh, the answer to that is... Sort of. Okay. Um... I did make it. I didn't say, uh... I can make two without taking damage, so technically according to the rules of e exactly what I said, you're not a lawyer's. I managed to avoid the flames with calculated patience and expertise. Um, Why didn't you use the anti-thermal suit? The one you used to hide from the sensors. Fuck It should have protected you. you from the fire and you could just walk through. Because it was erased from my memory. My mind couldn't recall that I had the suit. I... The same mind that told me about the suit a little while ago? The human brain has great regenerative power. Mm -hmm. You barely know how it works. Mm -hmm. So, in other words, you didn't think to use it. Shut up. Uh, more or less. Shut up. Well, Mr. Fox, please continue with your story. Look at me go! Nothing can stop me here. Oh, look, I'm gonna punch this thing. Oh, I can't. Oh, yeah, look at me go. I'm... I'm the smartest... I just wanted the... It was the challenge... It just... I wanted the achievement. Oh. I was expecting more dialogue for having done that. Well, there was nobody in the room, but my instincts told me it was a perfect place for a trap. Oh no. Well, the doc I don't think the doctor is going to be too mad at me if I kill these things, right? Okay. Uh, let's uh, equip that. I should have time to heal up. Good. And one more. Oh, come on. Oh, shit. Uh, oh, shit. Shit, 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 shit. I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm fine. Okay, one more. Got him. Boss defeated. Gunslinger reloads the gun automatically. Enemies further than four yards can't detect you if you're flat against the wall. That one, obviously. What the hell? Who would ever want to reload the gun? Or who would ever... I mean, that's not quite what I meant to say. Who would ever need to have the gun automatically reload? And don't say me. Don't say me, just because it's an accurate statement to say me. Uh, because I'm not going to pay attention to that ever. But, um, you know, only, only, only punk asses need that ability. No, I want to be impossible to be seen so that I can use the mechanics of this game to my full advantage-itude. I'm going to do that. And then I'm going to take a trip to the P corner real quick. 
And now, we'll head out. Oh, I suppose this means I could have been shooting the... Wait, what? Huh. I forget that you have to equip the key. That's such an odd choice. I hate that. I think that's a bad decision. I wonder, uh, though... There's something I didn't check out. And that is, we have this odd little side tunnel here. Ow. Okay. Yeah, that's what I wasn't sure about. But is there anything good over here? Was this worth my time? The answer is, of course not. I sort of want to blow these things up, but I don't know how, so I'm not going to. But it doesn't diminish my desire to blow them up any less. Nevertheless, I will, uh... It was with a heavy heart that I will not blow those things up. Just imagine what could have been. Well, I won't do anything. Who am I kidding? Okay. Is this gonna yield a vent or something like that? Oh, there's the... That's what I'm looking for. Hell yeah. I don't know who keeps a metal detector down in the electrical facility, but they shouldn't have, or should have. They did. All right, I'm just wanting to see if there's anything behind it. Their taint. So we'll head back up to the, to the top side. I had kind of forgotten that the whole reason I was going down here in the first place was to try and find something to allow me to progress over here. Okay. I mean, everyone knows that the way you actually uh, navigate a minefield is you're just supposed to uh, crawl around. Am I supposed to call Colonel, somebody? Do you copy? Copy. Colonel, I have the metal detector. Listen, Fox, those things have a very short range. Of course they do. Tread carefully, or the only thing left of you will be a crater. Oh, I bet that now that I um interesting. I was gonna say, but now that I have a metal detector, the mine field acts a little bit differently. Okay, this, this looks good. Man, this guy, he got through a pretty hefty minefield. His, he's a nature's metal detector. Alright. I'm kind of surprised I'm not finding, like, coins or, uh, guns or something. Or, like, some- somebody's lost jewelry. You know, typical metal detector shit. We good? We good! You know, if you lay out all these mines in a Fibonacci spiral, uh, you'll, uh, you'll never wind up with a open path like this. Oh god, there's one right there. <laughs> Alright, can I roll through the mines? The answer is not... Well, okay. Get that achievement. Uh, 
Uh-huh. Yeah, yeah, of course you're gonna put one right there. Just to, just to really mess everyone's day up. Okay. Safe. Very close to not safe. Should be good. Okay. I think I'm fine. Yay! Not gonna let me see, not gonna give me a free save this time? Lame. Oh shit! Okay, fine. Mines weren't the only threat. Oh the no. The was home to ferocious hunters. I noticed the presence of... Flies and frogs. Flies aren't that bad, but frogs, they can tongue you good. Arrowhead frogs. Oh no. It's poison. Lethal. I should have known. A scratch could make me croak. Nice. Okay, there aren't mines in the arrowhead frog uh, gauntlet, are there? Nice. That's actually made a lot easier on account of the fact that I uh, have the speed upgrade when there aren't enemies. Hmm. Odd. Very odd. What is this? I thought there'd be like a secret or something. Really weird. What's happening here? Huh. Alright. Uh. You think. I thought. Hmm. This whole area looks like it should be. Some sort of secret, right? You can walk around up here. It's out of the way. It doesn't seem to accomplish anything. Huh. Probably fine. That's gonna be a little bit stealthy there. Wow, this thing really does have a short range. The Colonel was right. Okay. 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 Perfect. Welcome to the jungle. Make the same jokes. You think it looks so much like there should be a secret? What the hell? Okay. Oh, when you run up against the wall, you still do the running sound effect. Okay, I thought I thought I actually did stumble upon something. Why is this tree a different shade than the others? A little sus. It looks like one of those Hanna-Barbera trees. You know, the ones that are about to be used. You're supposed to be able to... They're they're the ones that are going to be animated, so they While have a different kind of cell that jungle, I found something. Oh no! Or rather, someone. Doctor? Oh no! That better not be the doctor. I saw the rotting remains of an escaping prisoner. Yeah. It had a note. If you're reading this note, then I'm dead. Okay. My name is Henry Stanley, and I was in prison <gasps> for a crime what? I didn't commit. Damn, just like me. After escaping from my cell, I ran away through the sewers, then ended up in the Alpha building. Damn, I just like me. I managed to leave that damn building, but now I'm lost in this tropical hell. I've spent 30 years trying to leave this damn jungle, but no luck. I'm old, and my strength is fading. I won't last long. These are my last words. These were his last words. Other than the note, there was a compass, but the needle was missing. 
A broken compass was useless, so I didn't take it. That's a good point. How am I going to find my way out of this damn jungle, though? If a man as intelligent and as uh, adventurous as Henry Man, or whatever his name was, can't do it, then what hope is there for me? Does it is it actually generating like random trails and stuff like that for me? Huh. Looks like it. Yeah, I think so. Because I thought I would find my way back to uh, Henry Stanley's body, but no. Another corpse. No, it's just the same one. I searched the corpse. It was also rotting and gripping another compass. The needle was also <laughs> missing. Someone Weird how that happened or twice. Something in this jungle was stealing compass needles. There was a secret pocket in his ragged clothes. Within, I found a note. If you only found this note, then someone else stole my other what? note. What? Another note? Damn. Someone passed by before I did and stole this poor man's note. This is such I chaos. I know what the other note said. Wow. Yeah, I'll never put one and one together to figure out what the other note says. Huh. So, yeah. What do I do? Are the notes in my inventory? Am I supposed to combine them? No, I guess not. All right. Maybe if I approach from the other... If I approach from the other side, then I think that this guy will think he found a third corpse. A third corpse? Oh my god! Fuck. That jungle was more dangerous than I expected. <laughs> Unbelievable. It was rotting too. Like the others, it had a compass on it. Don't tell me. The needle was missing. Exactly. Could it be that you were running into the same corpse over and over again? I commend you for coming to the same conclusion. I passed by seven times to confirm it. I was wandering in circles. The damn jungle was toying with me. I had to orient myself somehow or I'd end up spending 30 years in that maze of trees. I tried to direct myself by watching the stars. But the damn top-down view only let me see the ground. So, I had to find another way to gain direction. Okay, we'll loot the body. And we get the needleless compass. And I can combine the needleless compass with the rusty wire. What was the diameter of the compass, Mr. Fox? Around two inches. And how long was the rusty wire, Mr. Fox? Six or seven inches. Wasn't it a little too long to place it inside the compass? I'm stupid, but not that stupid. I just used a small piece of plastic. <laughs> I ripped off a piece of my teeth before placing it. Oh, God, no. <laughs> but that wire wouldn't have been magnetized. How did you expect it to work? Modern compasses don't need the wire to be magnetized. Just turns out the compass wasn't modern. I was looking at the compass thinking of how to make it work when something caught my eye. In the middle of the grass, something glimmered under the pale moonlight. I... In my peripheral vision, I noticed I was not the only one to spot it. Oh, hell no. I'm stupid, but not that stupid. Might be one of the most candidly incredible lines I have ever heard in a video game. Ah, oh, I want that just engraved on a tombstone. Not mine, because I'm not that stupid, but a tombstone. I also, I don't know why I immediately thought to combine it with the rusty wire. I just, something in my heart said it was the right thing to do. Okay, can I grab a landmine? Oh, coin. Aha. If I grab a landmine, I can blow the blow the thing up. 
All right. Let's try again. Uh, hang on. If I approach from this side, it won't land. Yep, yeah, yeah, I know, I know. I know! Okay, if I throw the coin and I just, like, wait far away from it, will it drop the thing? There we go. <gasps> a needle! I can use this with the compass. Aha! I want to go west. I want to go south. This is how Kumpai work. And then, I think I can figure that one out. South? Aha! What the hell is that thing? What? Oh my god, it's got health. Uh. Ow! Jesus, it's got range too! Oh. Okay, I'll just remember the route. What the hell is that guy, though? I hate it. I go down here. And then I need to go west, okay? Let's punch this thing. I think that's supposed to be a weird plant. Oh, good. There's more of thems. Got a lot of health. And then south. We could just go for that. South again. Ow. And east. Okay. I'm gonna break this box. Uh, I'm also gonna go ahead and heal up, I think. I get the feeling that I'm gonna be... Uh, fighting a boss real soon on account of the fact that that chest just dropped three <laughs> things of bullets. All right. I bet it's gonna be a big one of these friends. All right, all right, all right. Ow. Okay, north. Easy enough. Oh my god, okay. Huh. I think it just... Damn it. I think it just got uh, confused and tried to hit me through the top of the screen. Oh. If you guessed I pressed the wrong button for the seven trillionth time playing this game, you would be correct. Ow! I beg of you, game. How long is this segment gonna be? This... The thing that I don't quite like about Unmetal is that it does tend to drag a little bit. I should heal up. These things are going to one-shot me at this point. And then, hang on, hang on, hang on. South, okay. Uh, east? Oh, okay, there's going to be a secret here. Challenge unlocked Colonel. What happens if I call the Colonel, Colonel? Do you read me? Loud and clear, Fox. Colonel, I think I'm past all the mines. Well done, Fox. See if you can commandeer an escape vehicle. I will try, Colonel. Okay. How's it coming along, Fox? I'm still searching for a hot ride. <laughs> Sorry, Colonel. I'll tell you when I find one. How's it coming along, Fox? I'm still searching for a hot ride. <laughs> Sorry, Colonel. I'll tell you what. Uh, the Colonel and I have something in common. Jesse here. Do you copy? I hear you. I was thinking about those big concrete blocks you saw. This place is full of concrete buildings. Maybe they're building something. Isn't this something just... new? Something okay. that requires. How's it coming nah, along, shit. Fox? Robert, still there. Yep. Okay, and then line three Jesse, is still no nothing. Over. You'd think it'd be the doctor. Uh, all right. Find the secret. Find the secret. I'm gonna guess. Okay, I don't need to use the comp. 
the compass. I'm gonna see what happens if I use the metal detector. Where are you at? Where are you at, secret? Interesting. Hmm. What about up to the right here? Okay. Hmm. Well, my video game instincts do sometimes say that if you uh, walk around in something in a circle three times, it'll occasionally spawn something. Okay, wrong. How about here? All right. There's like a slivery crack. I wonder what happens if I shoot a bullet down it or something. Nothing. That looks very, very much like the tiny passage. Oh. Just punch the tree. Okay. I thought I did punch the tree. I guess I need to punch it twice. Incredible puzzle. No idea how I could have ever figured that out. Attention! Are you ladies the new recruits? Fuck, you're the saddest bunch I've <laughs> ever met. And I've seen stacks of shit taller than you are. You think you're macho because you stuck your dicks in... Sir, I saw someone behind the fence. Fuck, scumbag, did I tell you to watch the damn fence? <laughs> no, sir. Then does a fence remind you of your mother, motherfucker? Here, you don't see. You don't listen. You don't speak. <laughs> Until I order you, is that clear? Yes, sir. Where are you from, boy? From Minnesota, sir. Minnesota? Only two things come out of Minnesota. Men and soda. <laughs> I don't see you bubbling, so you must be a men. What's a men, sir? Do I look like a scientist to you, piss <laughs> No, sir. You're not worth an urban dictionary entry, shit stain. Oh. What do you do at night, scumbag? I sleep, sir. Sleep? Well, excuse me, princess. Does she need a little nap? We don't get beauty sleep. We take shifts, bitch. <laughs> we train. We go the extra mile. What a line. When do we sleep, sir? During your break time, your highness. But, sir, it's a 15-minute break. Then sleep fast, fuck! <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> what happened to your eyebrows? They're shaped, sir. You <laughs> Are you the bitch of the yard? Sir, it's personal hygiene, sir. <laughs> the only reason people get clean is to get fucked. Do you plan on fucking me, bitch? <laughs> no, sir. Do you plan on fucking the enemy? No, sir. If I see these eyebrows shaped again, I will shape... Your balls <laughs> oh, no. oh, God. Is that clear? <laughs> yes, sir. <laughs> hey, where the this fuck is the best. you come from? You're so ugly, you could be a modern art masterpiece. <laughs> Did your father fucking orangutan? Oh, my God. Sir, no, sir. <laughs> fuck your face is a sales pitch for Congress. <laughs> <laughs> Have you ever seen a dick? Yes, sir. You can't be serious. What? Sir, no, sir. So you've never screwed in a light bulb? Sir, yes. No, sir. I, I don't know what to say. You say what I tell you to say. Sir, yes, sir. What's your sole purpose in the ex-army, asshole? To do whatever you tell me, drill sergeant. Nice. God damn it, boy. That's, That's the, the most outstanding, most outstanding answer, answer I've, I've ever, ever heard. heard. Yep. Thanks, sir. <laughs> now get out of here. Go back to your barracks. Next group! It wasn't wise to use weapons there. Oh, I tried to shoot him in the back. It wasn't wise to use weapons there. How, how much? Platoon! Attention! Does he just do the Are whole thing again? the new recruits? Fuck, you're the saddest bunch Probably. I've ever met. 
And I've seen stacks of shit taller than you are. You think Let's see what happens if I don't interrupt them. Your dicks in God knows what hole. I'm going to beat you shit stacks into weapons of war. Even if it kills you. Is he going to say Minnesota? From, yep. from Minnesota, sir. Minnesota. Only two things come out of Minnesota. Men All right. and soda. That's phenomenal. Bubbling, so you must be a man. That's references to many uh, drill sergeant scenes in movies. Obviously Full Metal Jacket, but then also Forrest Gump. Uh, good shit. what looked like the exit of a barracks. Yeah, it looks like one to me. Hey, Mike. I'm late and I have to take this truck to the fort. Are you going to open the damn door or not? Hold on, I'm opening it. My instinct told me the gate was going to open and a truck was going <laughs> to open. <laughs> My instinct. I could sneak onto the truck and get far away from here. See you later. Yo, Mike. Mike. What's up? Hold on. I need to verify the departure permit. Fuck, Mike, hurry up! Yeah, yeah. Look how all the clones are named Mike. Okay, anything... Anything I care about? Nope. Short segment. Maybe. Yo, Mike! Can I leave now? Negative. <gasps> Lieutenant cancel the delivery. What? You'll have to come back in. Oh, holy fuck. The stars are brightly shining. Ah, that was a short chapter. Look at that, nine out of nine, three out of three secrets. Don't look at the other number, but look at how good I did. Aren't I smart?